U.S. President Barack Obama said the official in the Internal Revenue Service responsible for targeting conservative political action groups for tax audits has been removed from his position and that his administration will do what it takes to make sure America's main tax collection agency is fair and apolitical. I've reviewed the Treasury Department watchdog's report and the misconduct that uncovered is inexcusable. It's inexcusable, and Americans are right to be angry about it, and I am angry about it. I will not tolerate this kind of behavior in any agency, but especially in the IRS, given uh, the power that it has and the reach that it has in all of our lives. And uh, as I said earlier, it should not matter what political stripe you're from. Uh, the fact of the matter is, is that the IRS has to operate with absolute integrity. The government generally has to conduct itself in a way that is true to the public trust. Uh, that's especially true for the IRS. The U.S. president said Stephen Miller, acting commissioner of America's federal tax agency, has handed in his resignation and it has been accepted. An inspector general's report said the IRS started targeting American conservative groups, including the Tea Party, in March 2010. The group is intensely anti-Obama, and one of its leaders is former presidential hopeful Michelle Bachman, who has suggested recent natural disasters are God, punishing Americans who voted for liberals. Eric Holder, the U.S. Attorney General, said the investigation into possible wrongdoing by the IRS will be thorough and apolitical. Besides Holder's Justice Department, three congressional committees are investigating the IRS, and the FBI is looking into potential civil rights violations by the agency as well.